asthma weed or tawa tawa. Euphorbia herda or popularly known in the Philippines as tawa tawa or gatas gatas is a hairy herb that just resides in the backyard, roadsides and pathways. This common weed, tawa tawa, is claimed to have healing properties on dengue patients as being backed up by personal testimonies, it became one of the most popular folkloric medicine for dengue in the Philippines. As a folkloric treatment in the Philippines for dengue, tawa tawa has earned many anecdotal testimonies from those who purportedly became well from the plant's concoction, its leaves boiled like a tea and taken orally. It contains triterpenes, phytosterols, tannins, polyphenols, and flavonoids. This herb has gained widespread attention because of its ability to help patients recover from dengue. Folk wisdom regard it as a hemostatic, which may help explain why blood platelets increase after ingestion of a boiled decoction of the plant. Health benefits of asthma weed or tawa tawa plant. 1. Treatment for dengue fever. Tawa Tawa tea can boost platelet production which is important for treating dengue fever. But it should not be used for more than 24 hours or up to 2 or 3 days in the beginning stages of dengue fever. 2. Treatment for high blood pressure. Tawa Tawa tea lowers blood pressure by being an anti-diuretic agent, containing an angiotensin enzyme that decreases urine output. Your blood pressure will be lowered, heart rate will decrease and increase in cardiac output. 3. Skin Problems the fresh sap of the plant can be applied externally for treating wounds, boils, warts, fungi, and rashes, it will turn dark blue when applied. Plus a dried powder of the leaves can also be used for open wounds. 4. Anti-diuretic. Tawa Tawa tea is great for those who suffer from drinking too much coffee and becoming too dehydrated or drinking too much alcohol. This tea decreases urine output thus helping to prevent dehydration. It contains tannins and other compounds that reabsorb electrolytes and water into the system. 5. Treatment for respiratory health. Tawa Tawa is the good herb for people with asthma, if you will combine it with beta-2 blockers like terbutylene sulfate and salbutamol, Tawa Tawa can have the ability to dissolve sticky mucus and relax the bronchial muscles that can provide relief to your asthmatic symptoms, he best thing to do is to take about 3 to 4 cups of boiled Tawa Tawa leaves every day or you can try to burn or inhale the smoke from Tawa Tawa leaves. If you know anything about incense, you can do the same thing with Tawa Tawa leaves for best results. 6. Relaxing Agent. Tawa Tawa tea also helps to soothe away anxiety and stress. For stress boil up to 50 grams of the fresh leaves in 4 cups water for 3 or 4 minutes, then drinking 3 to 5 cups a day. 7. Boosting the immune system. Tawa Tawa leaves are also known to boost the immunity of the body by boosting your immune system and protecting it from infection, oxidative damage and malignancies. There are a lot of constituents that Tawa Tawa leaves can offer like hexane, flavonoids, interpene and more. 8. Gastrointestinal tract. Tawa Tawa tea calms and soothes the gastrointestinal tract and puts an end to diarrhea. For diarrhea use, 1 teaspoon of the dried leaves steeped in 1 cup of water for 5 to 10 minutes and drink 2 or 3 cups a day. 9. Antibacterial, antifungal, and amoeba agent. Tawa Tawa tea is a good antibacterial, anti-amoeba, and antifungal agent that inhibits the growth of these infections, plus the tea can be used externally for treating athlete's foot. 
It's recommended for internal use to boil up to 50 grams of the fresh leaves in 4 cups water for 3 or 4 minutes, then drinking 3 to 5 cups a day. 10. Treatment for digestive health and dewormer. Tawa Tawa plant can actually help in our digestive health. Because of the active flavonoid constituent that is found in the plant, it has some anti-diarrhea properties. It can also be a great deworming agent. Here's the procedure on how to prepare a Tawa Tawa tea for dengue patients. 1. Take 5 to 6 whole Tawa Tawa plants. 2. Wash them thoroughly. 3. Cut off the roots. 4. Put the leaves in a boiling pot and add water. 5. Boil the Tawa Tawa on low fire for 5 minutes. 6. Let the concoction cool. 7. Dispose the leaves and stalks. Pour the colored liquid into the container. Cool. Before serving, add honey. Let the patient drink the tea in a glass. A minimum of four or five glasses of the tea a day is recommended. If you like this video please subscribe and share it to your friends. Don't forget to click the notification bell for more updates. Thank you for watching.